How's it going everybody? Right in the eye here, back to you guys with another video. We're talking about the AMD 300 series graphics cards yet again. Found this listings, or these listings on Amazon, and I would thought I would bring you guys this video here. We're going to talk everything from the R7 360 all the way up until the R9 390X. We'll just jump right in here. Here is a Gigabyte AMD R7 360 128-bit memory bus 2-gigabyte card. This card is going to be geared towards uh, people trying to play Dota 2, League of Legends, and um, uh, World of Warcraft and stuff like that at medium to low settings at 1080p 60 frames per second. This card is going to run you around $110 respectively, and again, it's going to be only 2 gigabytes of frame buffer. Back with the next card, we're going to be looking at this card here. Uh, the Gigabyte AMD R7 370, 256-bit uh, memory bus. This card is going to cost you around $150, and it's going to be those people trying to play the same types of game, Dota 2, League of Legends, and World of Warcraft, at 1080p, 60fps, and high to ultra settings, so the people want to max out those games. Alright, this card is going to have 2 gigabytes of frame buffer, as well as the 360 does. Next card we're going to talk about here is this uh, 380. This card is by MSI, it's is R9 380. This is the 2 gig version of this card, it's going to cost you $215. This card is going to be geared towards those trying to play um, their games at maybe 1440p. You could run this one, I'll show you guys a 2 gigabyte card here, in a, or 4 gigabyte car card here in a moment. I would recommend this card for the people trying to uh, max out 1080p for sure on all games at 60fps on Ultra, would be what I would recommend this card for with two gigs and we do have the four gig card here which is what I would recommend for 1440p gaming at medium to low settings 60 FPS at 1440p this card is going to have a 256 bit memory bus and four gigs of frame buffer and it's going to cost you two hundred and forty five dollars the next card we're going to look at here is the 390 we'll take a look at this 390 right here and this card is going to be three hundred and forty dollars. This card is going to be geared towards the people trying to play at four K, medium to low settings, maybe even high settings, at sixty FPS on games like The Witcher Three and stuff like that, uh, Arkham Knight and other things. This card has a five hundred and twelve bit memory bus and eight gigabytes of frame buffer. All right. Next, lastly, we have the. Gigabyte AMD R9 390X, 512-bit memory bus, 8 gigabyte of frame buffer card. This card is going to cost you $430, and it's going to be geared towards the people trying to play 4K um, and with uh, max settings at higher ultra 60 FPS on games like The Witcher 3, uh, Far Cry 4, and Your Dark Knight. This is the card that I would highly recommend instead of uh, going with the Crossfire configuration of uh, two uh, 390s. I would recommend just getting a single one of these cards and see how your performance does. Alright guys, this has been Right in the Eye here, bringing you guys another video about the AMD 300 series graphics cards. Please like this, like this video if you liked it. Please dislike this video if you disliked it and leave a comment below as to why you did so. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you very much for watching.